Hey guys, it's Hannah, and today I am here with another book review. And this is a book that I actually wanted to read for a while, and the reason why I hadn't gotten to it is because a lot of crazy stuff was going on, and I was reading another book, which is Love and 2263. I'm still reading it. I put it down because I was so busy with other things, but I decided, you know, I might as well pick up another book and read it. And holy crap, this book, I am so glad that I picked it up. I read it in two days. I could not put it down. It was so great. Anyways, so it is Poisoned by Jennifer Donnelly. It is a Snow White fairy tale retelling, and I absolutely loved this book. This book follows the Snow White tale very well, but it also has a great twist and I am so excited to tell you about it. This book, this is a must read for any fairy tale lover like myself because this book is super good. Um, so this book was first published in October of 2020 by Scholastic Press and I think this is the edition that I have, the first edition cover right here. I have never seen any other cover like this, but this cover is super, super cute. It's got the poisoned apple in the front that's all crushed up and the title in front. And this little uh, side title says, Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the deadliest of them all? And this book, I loved this book. So there you go, the front and the side and the back. And it also has a little preview for another one of Jennifer Donnelly's books, which is Stepsister, which is based on Cinderella. And I've also got another one of her books called Deep Blue, which I believe is based on The Little Mermaid. But yeah. Break the, the enchanted mirror, crush the poison apple, and seize your own happily ever after. So this book is about a girl named Sophie. Um, she is the princess, of course, and she is soon to become queen of the Kingdom of the Greenlands. And um, at the beginning of the story, it begins with Sophie and the Huntsman going into the woods. And like in Snow White, you know, the Huntsman is sent by the evil queen to kill Snow White. But he actually kills Sophie at the beginning of the story. He kills her and cuts out her heart. But she survives. She is rescued by the seven brothers. Um, it's implied that they're um, like a family. I think they're adults. I don't really know, but they're kind of children, adults, I don't know. But they're brothers. They rescue her and they make a clock engineered um, mechanical heart in place of the heart that was taken from her. So that's how she survives. And apparently it is discovered that the queen is, she's evil, of course, but she's serving somebody called the King of Crows who has stolen Sophie's heart. So this whole story is, you know, the King of Crows wants Sophie dead and is controlling the evil queen. And the queen tries multiple times to kill Sophie and of course you know she the poison apple is one of the methods that she uses and you know eventually Sophie is able to get her heart back um she falls in love with a archer named Will and they have a little adventure together and yeah this book is really really good I really enjoyed this book a lot I read through it in two whole days like I think I read like 20 chapters and then that was last night and then today I read the rest of the book and like I thought okay I just want to take a break and just do something else but I was like nope I'm just gonna keep on going and I'm glad that I kept on going this book is so great it is a page turner you will not get bored reading this book I'm going to give it five stars. I think Jennifer Donnelly is an excellent author and I'm definitely going to be checking out Deep Blue as well as Stepsister. So yeah, that was my review of Poisoned. Great, great, great book. So that's it. If you guys have anything you want me to read or check out, just let me know. And I really hope you enjoyed this review. I am so glad that I read this book. 
and I'm definitely going to be reading it again. And it is, and it is now currently my favorite fairy tale retelling. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys again soon.